In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a Terminator face effect using Photoshop. You can download the images in the description down below to follow along. First open this image in Photoshop. Bring the Terminator's head to your main project. Right click and choose Convert to Smart Object. Press Ctrl T to adjust its size. Add a curve adjustment layer, clip it, and follow these settings. Add a color adjustment layer, clip it and follow these settings. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer, clip it and follow these settings. Press Ctrl T and adjust the head size and position like so. Add a layer mask and press Ctrl I to invert it. Press B and choose this textured brush. Download link in the description down below. Lower the flow and set the background color to white. Follow the process. Right-click and choose Blending Options. Select Inner Shadow and follow these settings. Keep adjusting the effect until you are satisfied. Add a solid color adjustment layer. Pick a red color. Right click and choose create clipping mask. Press Ctrl I to invert the mask. Press B and choose a soft round brush Increase the flow, set the foreground color to white and follow the process. Lower the flow and paint inside the eye socket. Right click and choose blending options. Hold Alt to split the transition and follow the process. Press Ctrl J to duplicate the layer. Select the mask, press Ctrl A and press Delete to reset the mask. Press Ctrl D to deselect. Press B and select a hard round brush, reduce the flow and follow the process.
Right click, choose blending options and follow these settings. Select both layers and change the blending mode to screen. Keep adjusting the effect if needed. Add a brightness and contrast adjustment layer. Drag it to the top and follow these settings. Press Ctrl I to invert the mask. Press B and choose a soft round brush. Adjust the flow and follow the process. Select the bottom layer and bring the metal part to your project. Download link in the description. Press Ctrl T and place it like so. Add a curve adjustment layer, clip it and follow these settings. Add a color adjustment layer, clip it and follow these settings. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer, clip it and follow these settings. Add a layer mask and press Ctrl I to invert it. Press B, select the texture brush and follow the process. Hold Alt and drag the inner shadow effect to copy it. Select the top layer and press Ctrl plus Alt plus Shift plus E to merge all the visibles together. Right-click and choose Convert to Smart Object. Go to Filter and choose Camera Raw Filter. Copy these settings. That's it I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel for more tutorials. Also, check out other videos on my channel. Thank you for your support.